What's going on? It's Joe Fu from Z104 here with the legendary Charlie Murphy. Charlie Murphy, Charlie that's Murphy. Murphy. Darkness. Do people, do people still yell darkness at you? Yes, they do. They, yeah. they still yell that. They still yell all this stuff. Do the buck nasty shake. <laughs> <laughs> now, I mean, is it crazy that they're still talking about the Chappelle show? No. No. It's still a good show. It's still like it, it hasn't been tapped. So. Yeah, yeah, I mean, it's amazing. I mean, yeah. just the longevity of that show. And I just wondered, as an artist, you know, because you've done so many different things. You've traveled the world, sold out shows everywhere. But, I mean, does it get annoying hearing about it? Or are you just like, oh, man, no, I love that? No, I'm, it, it's my, it's, it's my life. I'm never going to get annoyed. Okay. Like that, you know. Uh, I'm in show business. That's that's what you work for, so, you know, uh, to, to be in a project that, that connects, you know. And yeah. that project connected, so I'm happy about that. And I have a new project, a new TV show uh, that debuts next Thursday, man. I fact, know about it. I can't wait to hear it. Yeah. Called Black Jesus. <laughs> Your boy Charlie Murphy's back on television at 11 p.m. Thursday nights. Can you please Check tell me us? Out. Can you please tell us a little bit about? I I I I've been waiting to. When they told me you were coming in, I was like, mm -hmm. I gotta ask him about Black Jesus. What's it all about? Well, it's it's um, it's like if Jesus was to come back and he's he's in the hood. And his uh, his disciples are guys from the hood, and he's uh, he's giving them life lessons. He's teaching them, you know, good stuff. My character, on the other hand, doesn't believe that he's Jesus. I'm his arch enemy. The whole I'm not the devil. But I'm just I don't believe this guy's Jesus, and I'm co I'm continuously antagonizing. I can't wait. Yeah, very funny. Very so funny. it's uh, created it's by okay. Aaron McGruder. If you're a Boondocks fan, you understand the humor. Uh, Created by the same guy, you know. Very cool. Very good. And when, when was it again? August seventh, eleven p.m. Adele Swim. Check me out. Cool. We'll laugh. I promise. Uh, how could you not? I, just the premise of that is it's it's hilarious. hilarious. Jesus in the hood, and he's teaching the disciples. Well, well some, was, some people get that angry about that. You know, I read some comments. There was some people that was like, "How could you do a show when you have Jesus in the ghetto?" And I'm like, uh, "If he." came when he came last time that's where he was at exactly the people who were around him they weren't rich they were they were the people that were being oppressed the people that didn't have you know so where do you find those people now i get it in the hood yeah so i don't know what they, what was you know maybe people would have been more comfortable if we cast him and had him and uh, driving to maybach and living in beverly hills but that's not the direction we went no, I mean, that's not the story of Jesus, if you know it. Not to get on that, but, I mean, if it's funny, it's going to be it's funny. funny, man. It's and funny. that's that, That's what changes everybody's it's idea. It's funny. And I'm a, I'm a devout believer in God, so for anyone who wants to say, and you're going to hell, Charlie, but listen, man, <laughs> I believe in the same God you believe in, and he may be funny, and that's why we did a funny show. That's Very something. good. Well, Charlie's in town. He's going to be at the Funny Bone all weekend, Friday, Saturday, and all Sunday. All weekend, man. Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Okay. Any they said it was going to rain. I bought some nice white deck shoes. I'm going to be able to wear them this weekend, I guess. But everything else going to be, you know. What could we look for in the show? Any new stories that you... I, I oh, mean, yeah. I, got, I, I never come here without new stuff, man. You know, people who've seen it before, they know that. I've been to Virginia Beach now almost a, a decade. I think I've seen you here. almost every time. Yeah, and I, you know, I always come back with new stuff. That's the reason why they keep letting me come back. My that's favorite the story. Have, don't have no pie anywhere <laughs> on me. So. My favorite stories that you do, of course, always revolve around Prince. When right you on. tell the Prince stories and just but I don't, I don't tell the Prince story in my stand up. No. 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 I don't. I don't. I don't tell the Prince story. I don't tell the Rick James story. Uh, I actually don't even talk about Chappelle show. I've been doing stand up for twelve years now. Right? Yeah, yeah. The show's been off the air. I mean, I've been out of out of uh, production the entire time. But when did so, you talk about in the very his beginning? Hair? In the very beginning, that's when I that was like my first stand up set, and that's on my DVD that I put out, Charlie Murphy album. That's then that's 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 what I was. I've about. since done like a, a five or six more hours of stand up. So for me, the thrill is to do that, not to um to revisit. You know, it's all part of part of one body of work. But I always work at the end. What's the new stuff? What's happening right now? You know, what's current? And, uh, and, and that's what works for me. So who are you talking about right now? Like who's kind of in the, not giving, like, giving us anything, but like uh, who's, who's, who's part of the, 
someone you can drop. You don't have to tell us. Name, much. name yeah. wise, uh, there's no particular person I'm talking about. I'm talking more about me now as far as yeah. the name personality. I just wonder because you interact me. with so many different people. Right. So I was just wondering if there was somebody that we well, all. A lot of my stuff is current, excuse me, current event based. You know, it's like uh, what's happening right now in the world is what I'm going to be talking about. What's What's right in front of you? What are the things that you looked at and was like, you know what? That seems odd to me, but you didn't take it any further. You know, I took it a whole lot further. And that's why when I bring these topics up, people in the audience know what I'm talking about and we have fun with it. Have you been traveling a lot the past year? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Where, where, where have you been this year so far? I've been, far? Uh, wow. Bro, I had to take a list out to show you. Really? Yeah, every week I'm Well, what's been your favorite? So far, like to go to, to, to be go. honest with you, my favorite is when I play in New York because I get to go home in that, you know. And, and my favorite show this year was uh, the, the show I did with Dave Chappelle at Radio City. Dave Chappelle recently uh, made a comedy history, he did 11 straight sold out shows at uh, Radio City. He had uh, as his guest, he had Erica Badu, uh, Busta Rhymes, Kanye West, uh, The Roots. Uh, I don't leave anybody out. Uh, he had so many different power hitters, Nas, you know, they all came through and Charlie Murphy was able to be a part of that. So I'm gonna always be, you know, uh, humbled by that. that I, was, I got to come and do some time with this. I was supposed to do 30 minutes, I accidentally did 38. But um, <laughs> <laughs> I had so much fun in that. Did you? It was a blast, yeah. So you, you did one night out of the 11? You were I did one night because you know each one, each night he had one. Like Eric Badu was one night. Okay. He did, Kanye West was one night. Gotcha. The Roots was one night. Nas was another night. You know he had all these different powerhouse groups coming up. And, I, and you know, one night that he did all com comedy, he had uh, Donald Rollins, Ashley Larry, and myself and and him, and it was a great show. That's amazing, man. And it's, it's amazing I, to be standing in front of a crowd at Radio City and kill. That, that's what was amazing. I'm never gonna forget that experience. That's really cool. Is that is that gonna be on video? Is are they gonna release I hope, those? I hope they make a concert movie out of it because it you know it has all the elements. You know you had all these power powerhouse groups. They all ripped all of them. Nas uh, introduced uh, Illmatic Two on that on that show. And uh, yeah, if they t make it into a concert movie, I think that'd be very powerful. It's nothing. Nobody else got that many. Uh, different groups or acts along with their show to package in the game. No. He's the only one. Yeah, because I, I remember his movie with the, the Block Party. Right, thing. right, like, right. Th that was this just... would be better than the Block Party. Blow it, blow it out? Oh, yeah. Well, it's I that mean, Radio City, man. Yeah, yeah well, yeah. And, and this was him coming back, like kind of mm -hmm. doing another. I, I mean, it's right, just amazing. Right. Another chapter, another yeah. chapter. Very Definitely. cool, Charlie. I mean, that's. And Dave killed it as usual, so. I can't wait. You know, if, they, if they do put that into a concert movie, I can't wait to see that. Very cool. Well, we appreciate you coming by, hanging out with us at uh, 95.7 and Z104. You That's always right. come through. I always come through. Always yeah, come through. always come through. And we love it. And like then, Jim Morrison, I break on through to the other side. I always come through. <laughs> <That's what> <laughs> <laughs> Jim Morrison. No one on Z104 knows who Jim Morrison is. But they but should. But I know. But they should. And the real heads out there, you know. Right. You can teach these youngins some real science. Tell them who Jim Morrison is. <laughs> Pretty cold through. Well, appreciate your time. Go see Charlie Murphy at the Funny Bone all weekend. He will not let you down. I'm telling you. He will not let you down. And uh, thank you for coming through, Charlie. Good luck with uh, Black man. Jesus. Thank you. Um, I'm, I'm going to be watching. Watch I cannot wait. I cannot Make wait. sure you hit me up on Twitter and let me know what you think, man. I definitely can't. At Charlie Murphy on Twitter. And you can also check out my podcast, Charlie Murphy Presents, which is on SoundCloud and iTunes. I'm all over the place, baby. <laughs> Charlie Murphy. I'm breaking on through to the other side. Jim Morrison. The other side. <laughs>